Okay, what is up ladies and gentlemen, my name is Gabe and today I'm going to be bringing you the top upcoming graphics cards of 2015, so let's go. I'm going to be going over the AMD and NVIDIA. Um, both of those, we're going to be looking over the best ones for each of those companies. Um, so yeah, let's go, let's get into AMD first. So, I already have some stuff lined up. As you can see, um, AMD is supposed to be releasing the AMD Radeon R9 390X, which is going to be arriving early 2015 um it and apparently it may feature the hydro liquid cooling which is um liquid cooling in the card um <clears throat> so yes um it, it does span a six month period from january to june um so it will be in between that that is released and apparently it's supposed to have the hbm instead of gddr5 um dram which is a lot faster times one zero two four i o b two times thirty two which is a lot a lot faster um and apparently the card is allegedly to be the first single gpu um, reference board to come with hybrid liquid cooling similar to the dual gpu r9 290 295 x which is the fastest graphics card in the world at the present moment so it's supposed to be faster than the fastest graphics card ever made um with hydro liquid cooling which is awesome i'm you might actually be thinking of switching to amd and i might actually think of doing that because this card is supposed to be amazing compared to what I've heard about the NVIDIA card releasing. So let's get into the specs. Um, this is supposedly what the card is going to look like. Uh, does I I personally think this looks pretty cool. Um, I would love it if they weren't going to have the water cooling to have dual fans because that always keeps it cooler. But if it's water cooling, who cares? That looks really awesome. Here are the specs. Um, of course, it's unreleased AMD um, release date. Apparently now they've moved it to January 2015, this, this site has, and it will only be $600. I know only, but apparently it's supposed to be better than the 980 and 970. So 980 is around $780. Um, the, for the EVGA model, just the, the stock model, not all the crazy stuff. So this is cheaper than it. it's supposed to be way faster than it. Um, base clock is 1200 megahertz and the memory clock is 1750 megahertz, which is crazy um so yeah that is this card this card is supposed to be crazy um yes yeah, so let's go into the nvidia okay now we are going to be in um going into the nvidia geforce um maxwell lineup cards um of course as you know the 700 series re was released and then as we all thought it was going to be the 800 then 900 but they did skip the 800 series and they came out with the 900 series the 970 980 all those crazy cards that you hear about which are way better and way cheaper than the 700 series especially the 780 ti which is was the leading graphics card um for gaming but now the 980 ti or the 980 is um, leading and 970 is almost as good as it with a price of only around 300 to 400 dollars so yes they but they are going to be releasing the 800 series just for some reason out of order in late 2015 these are the rumors um, it's going to be the Maxwell lineup of cards, um, and these are the models that are going to, be, going to be released. And apparently the 850 is also going to be released, but 860, 870, 880, and 880 Ti, just like the 780 Ti and the 700 series and the 900 series. So I did find some specs um, for the 8, um, 880 card, um, and it faces off against the 780, and it is supposed to be significantly cheaper with a um, with a GPU um, boost performance is going to be it's going to be better than the 780. Um, so yeah, here are the here are the FPS benchmarks on high settings for these games against the 780 and the 880. And of course, the 880 does outperform it. Um, maybe on the the more graphically intense games, it does not outperform it as much as um, you'd want it to. But it is, like I said, supposed to be cheaper. So with a 10 to 15 um, FPS boost for a lot less money is going to be awesome. Um, so yes, here are some other, uh, FPS tests for these cards. Oh, well, I guess not, but yes. So, it's there, they are all going to be, um, big cards, awesome cards. Um, so yes, these are actually, huh, wait a second. Oh, these are, these cards are actually made for laptops. So the, the laptop is going to be, the laptop card is going to be better than the 780. So that's, I guess that's all they've released so far. Uh, we do not know about the full card that you can put in your PC case yet, I guess. Huh. Well, anyway, 
thank you so much for watching i really do appreciate i appreciate it i am going to have a motherboard video just like this coming out we do not know much so please when i made this at least we do not know much um, about these cards so please don't say like oh you're so dumb we don't you there's so much more stuff i could not find anything with the research that i have done um so yes thank you so much for watching i really do appreciate it and feel free to check out the motherboard video that's going to be coming out in a couple couple days and merry christmas happy holidays adios